Hello everybody. Uh, today's video is a update on the fail boat that I did last time. And this one actually has foldable pontoons, uh, rod holders, cup holder, gonna have a dual battery and a way bigger motor. We got a 55 uh, thrust instead of the 30. And what I'm most happy about is the foldable pontoons on this one. They're out when you're on the water and for transporting, I've actually fold in. So they fold in for transport, uh, which fits in the back of my Ranger, which is, you know, a small truck. And when you're ready to hit the water, they just fold out and you lock them into place. First comes the build, then comes the water. Let's go.
Well, I did design the pontoons, uh, so there is a little step here. Uh, if I didn't add that, I could have actually made it a little shorter, but I want to step, make it a little easier to get on. came loose. Sorry, technical difficulties. <laughs> okay, uh, so far I'm actually pretty happy with this. I really like the addition that I added. This is actually the old boat that failed. Uh, this is part of it. Pretty much uh, drilled a hole, threw some foam in there, and it uh, locked it right in place. Cup holder, because everyone keeps mentioning uh, I needed a cup holder. All right, so don't forget to follow me on Instagram. Um, like and share, please, that helps out. And there is a link in the description to the book that shows you like, how I built this with like measurements and stuff, because it's just too long to include in the video. So um, I did want to mention my uh, crazy cameraman here. Uh, you want to do a shout out to your channel? Yeah, it's uh, not my day job. And it's just a, a mix of different things like vlogging and making things and gardening so check it out if you if you want to cool all right well that is a wrap it is like 98 degrees out here and it's almost high noon coming up so it's uh, a little warm so i think we're done for the day but uh appreciate it thanks for watching as always take care and god bless